Paris Saint-Germain looks set for a fire sale this summer with the club's owners reportedly hoping to trim down their eye-watering wage bill. Clubs all over Europe could be given a bargain opportunity to make a raid on Paris Saint-Germain this summer with the Ligue 1 giants reportedly hoping to slash their wage bill by 30%. Kylian Mbappe, Neymar and Lionel Messi are the highest earners at PSG, together earning a reported £200 million a year. But they aren't the only players earning mega money at PSG and it appears as though the club's owners are set to put many of them up for sale to help control some of their finances. According to the Times, Qatar Sports Investments have informed PSG officials that the wage bill must be slashed this summer due to a UEFA financial fair play settlement. It's been reported that PSG's wage bill has now reached a record £645 million a year and the skyrocketing costs led to the French side recording a net loss of £326 million for last season. The financial catastrophe could present transfer opportunities for clubs such as Arsenal this summer with Mikel Arteta keen to bolster his squad. Express Sport takes a look at three players Arsenal could viably sign from PSG if given the opportunity. Sergio Ramos, the Spanish football icon is currently set to be a free agent in the summer and PSG's financial position indicates that he's unlikely to be offered a new deal. At 36 years of age, Ramos is no longer the player he once was with his pace slowing down as well as fitness issues creeping in. Arsenal have stuck to their strict transfer plan in targeting young players to build around in the transfer market, but they're lacking in the experience department. Jorginho was signed late in the January window and his influence has already been felt at the Emirates. Even as a bit part player on a short-term deal, Ramos' presence would provide the perfect example for Arsenal's young crop of defenders to follow. And as one of football's most decorated players, Ramos would bring a wealth of experience in knowing how to handle the biggest occasion. Mauro Icardi. Mauro Icardi remains on Paris Saint-Germain's books, but it just hasn't worked out for the Argentine in the French capital. Originally seen as the final piece to PSG's attacking unit alongside Neymar and Mbappe, Icardi struggled to live up to expectations. He's now spending this season out on loan with Galatasaray and looks set to leave on a permanent basis in the summer. PSG will have to accept a loss on the £45 million plus fee they paid to sign Icardi back in 2020 and could be available in a bargain deal. Arsenal are still in need of bolstering their attacking options and Icardi has shown in Turkey that he's still able to find the net on a regular basis with 9 goals and 6 assists in just 12 matches. Renato Sanchez. Premier League fans will remember Renato Sanchez's ill-fated spell with Swansea back in 2017, but the midfielder has revived his career in League One. He played a crucial role in helping Lille win an incredible League One title back in 2021 before earning a move to PSG last summer. But the 25-year-old has struggled for game time in his first season at the Parc des Princes, starting just three league matches. Despite his lack of minutes, Sanchez is one of a few players PSG may be able to make a profit from this summer having only paid £12.5 million for his signature less than a year ago. Arsenal will make signing another midfielder a top priority this summer and PSG's financial position could mean that they'll listen to offers for all their players. And signing Sanchez may prove to be an astute piece of business if Arteta is able to get the midfielder back to the kind of form that saw Lille win the French title two years ago.